looking to include directions, parking information, or additional details about your business to your Clinico communications automatically, we've recently added an additional information placeholder to your templates. And in this video, I'll show you how to update your business, add additional information to your location details, and include the additional information placeholder in your communications. First, let's update your business details. To do this, you'll want to log in as an administrator or power receptionist and head over to Settings, Business Information. From here, select Edit Information on the business you'd like to update. Above the Services section, you'll then see the Additional Information field. Here, you might add directions to your business or parking information for your patients. Other options include any further information or details you want your patients to know to prepare for their booking. Once you've added your additional information, make sure to save your changes by selecting Update Business at the bottom of the page. You'll now want to repeat this process for any remaining business locations. Once updated, we'll now modify our communication templates. Additional information can be added to most of your communication templates within Clinico. For example, invoice emails, letters, confirmations, and reminders. To start, we'll update our confirmation emails. To do this, head over to Settings, Appointment Confirmations. From here, select the template you'd like to update. When editing the content of your communication template, you'll see a number of placeholder dropdowns. Within the business dropdown, you'll now see the additional information placeholder. You can add the additional information placeholder anywhere within your template. To view an example of your email, select view sample underneath the content of your template. Just note, when we send an email to your patient, we'll automatically replace the placeholder with the relevant information specific to the business location. Once you're ready to save your changes, select Update Confirmation Template. You'll want to repeat this process for any additional confirmation templates or any other communication templates you'd like to include the additional information placeholder. That completes this video, but as always, I'll be back for more news, tips, and updates in the future. If you have any questions regarding the changes and updates to Clinico, reach out to the support team. We'd be happy to help.